Tracking Hurricane Fiona this morning here on 10 Tampa Bay. Welcome back. We're your hurricane headquarters here. I want to show you a really cool picture from the hurricane hunters last night. They were flying through this storm right in the eye of the storm as the hurricane was intensifying very quickly. I think we have these pictures here. This is awesome. Uh, we got this. What you're looking at here is the center of the hurricane or what we call the eye of the storm. And in the eye of the storm, you have really sinking air. So that's why you have those clear skies and the hurricane hunters snap this picture. If you look closely, you can see the stars above the eye of Hurricane Fiona as it started to move away from the Dominican Republic last night. But again, a very quickly intensifying storm this morning. It went from a Cat 1 hurricane yesterday morning with 85 mile per hour winds to 115 mile per hour winds this morning as of the latest eight or uh, rather five o'clock advisor this morning. And we expect it to begin to intensify even more as we head throughout the rest of the day. Right now, though, it's moving to the north northwest at 10 miles per hour. Pressure's down to 967 millibars. The lower the pressure, the stronger the storm. So it's just east of the Grand Turk Island right now. It continues to turn to the northwest and then it'll start to curve back to the north and northeast. So it'll still steer clear of the United States, but it will produce some huge surf. 27 foot waves right now. The prediction is for those waves to climb up to near 45 feet before it begins the weekend much farther to the north, but potentially a cat four hurricane by later today. It approaches Bermuda by Friday morning and then it'll head up towards the Canadian Maritimes. We're keeping a close eye on this tropical wave approaching the Caribbean later this week. This system has a good chance of developing. We think over the next five days, really something to be concerned with as it moves into the warm waters of the Caribbean. Watch here. There goes Fiona. This is the GFS model showing it moving into the Caribbean, potentially becoming a hurricane by the middle of next week. This is just one run of the forecast model, but still we're, we're keeping a close eye on it, guys. Still very much so the peak of hurricane season.